So this is the, the Via Quad Core. Uh, it's a 1.2 plus. The model number is an L4700. And this platform is capable of uh, doing the adaptive overclocking, which allows it to uh, increase your performance automatically. So I, the power profile I'm using is the balance profile in Windows 7, which means it, it will, when idle, it goes to the minimum P state. But if I select it to go to the highest P state, the high performance, it will go to the highest P state available to it, and then whatever the processor can overclock to would give it this dynamic overclocking. So as you can see, when I tell it to go to high performance, we're now running at 1467, or 1466 as this is measuring. But uh, right now, the power load is very low, so we're getting this feedback from the, the voltage regulator to give us this in, the input of how much power we've been consuming over this period of time, and we're not consuming hardly anything, so we can boost this thing to all four cores up to uh, 1.46 gigahertz. But if I run a thermal virus on all four cores, this thing, as you're going to see, is going to go down to 1.2 gigahertz quite quickly. <laughs> now, it's going to, uh, as threads and uh, other task switches from Windows changes, uh, you're going to see some excursions here to 1.46, but it's not going to stay there very long. But it's going to run at 1.2 gigahertz, which is what we set the TDP for, because Prime 95 is a pretty high power uh, uh, instruction sequence on, on, the, on the cores and so this is what we would rate at 27 watts for this particular uh, bin but the minute I uh, kill oops and I stop the workers bam back to 1466 so let's do one thread and we'll do two what the heck so it's going to run two threads, and you're going to see mo a lot of you're getting a lot of opportunity for it to run at 1466. But we're still within this 27 watt power limit. So we're providing a lot more performance for the same TDP because the because <coughs> the TDP for a 1.46 quad core, if we ran all of those, would probably be in the uh, 45 watt range. But operating in this 27 watt headroom, we're able to you know, boost up quite a bit. So I can show you. Let's put this down there so you can see the threads. But let's do a four core benchmark. Something like uh, seven zip. This mouse is very touchy. Yeah, that looks terrible. So it's com uh, compressing on all four cores. You see it go 10. You see the processor frequencies changing, sometimes 1200, sometimes 1466, just as what the power load is uh, allowing it to. And it <coughs> that's why we call it a 1.2 plus. So this is the Via Quad Core L4700 doing its adaptive overclocking is what we're calling it. Intel calls it Turbo Boost. So on